I have a Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 Classic here. I'm going to show you two ways how you can perform a factory reset. Okay, we're going to do a hard reset using the keys on here, and we're going to try it. And you can also try to do a soft reset going from the app. Okay. All right. So the first way that you can uh, try to factory reset it is doing a soft reset. Simply go to your app. So let me go to my Samsung Galaxy um, wearable app. So Galaxy wearable app right here. Let me tap on that. And then from here, just go to watch settings. And then from here, go ahead and scroll down and just go to general. And then scroll down to the bottom here, it says reset. Tap on reset. Now also don't forget with the factory reset, you're gonna be losing all your information on here. So if you wanna back it up, you can back up your data to the Samsung account. You can back up data now, okay? And then you can reset or you can just, uh, just have a totally clean slate. You can go ahead and tap on reset right now to perform the factory reset. Now the other way to do a factory reset is a hard reset using the actual keys here. Okay, so watch very closely with this one. So first thing we wanna do is we wanna press and hold both buttons, okay? Press and hold both buttons and just wait until we see this, when you see the Samsung logo appear, let go of both buttons and then start spamming the top button here which is the power slash home button, okay? So just follow along with me, okay? So two buttons right here, ready? One, two, three, press and hold. Just keep on holding, wait for that Samsung logo to appear. Still holding here, waiting for the Samsung logo. And then, I'll, okay, there it is, go ahead and let go. And then power button, spam the power button. Oh, hopefully I did it soon enough. Okay, cool, I did. So from here, now listen very carefully, okay, about the buttons here, how to move up and down, okay? So for, for this screen here, you can use the power button, just tap it. So what you wanna do is we wanna go down to where it says recovery. Not sure if you can see that, but just go down, highlight recovery. So recovery is right there. Now to select it, we have to press and hold the power button now. So I'm gonna press and hold the power button, select recovery. Screen turns black, go ahead and let go. And now that we're gonna be booting up into another uh, screen now. I'll give this one second. And listen very carefully about the buttons because it's a little bit different to navigate again. So just wait here. Okay, so from here, now, you want to go down to where it says wipe data slash factory reset. Now to move down, use the bottom button here, okay? So we can move down. If you pass it, just go all the way through it again. Go all the way down until you see wipe data, flat, um, wipe data slash factory reset. Now if you want to proceed with the factory reset to select it, just tap on the top button, the power button here, okay? Tap it right there. Now we get a message here saying, um, Wipe all, uh, wipe all user data, this cannot be undone. So basically once we do this, we can't go back, okay? So if you wanna proceed with the factory reset, you wanna highlight factory data reset. So go down, highlight factory data reset and just select it, press on the power button right there and go ahead and let it do its thing. This whole process is probably gonna take about two or three minutes. And then, uh, okay, well, it boots us back up to a uh, reboot system now. That's exactly what we want. So press on the power button and then go ahead and let it do its thing. And then from here, it's gonna take like two to three minutes. So just be patient here. It'll stay on the Samsung logo for a little bit. Then it's gonna stay on this logo for a while. And voila. You just factory, I just factory reset this Watch 4 Classic. So pretty simple. Any uh, questions or issues? Uh, just comment below, all right? Good luck, guys. Bye.